Multi-logo from Crystal Vision, a space-saving, cost-effective, three-layer logo Kia. The perfect solution for HD or SD station branding. With up to 8 gigabytes of memory, Multi-Logo can store still frames, animated graphics and captured video for use with its three high-quality Kias. Multi-Logo can be used with industry standard automation systems or controlled by Crystal Vision's own easy-to-use PC software. Files stored on the PC are drag-and-dropped into Multilogo's internal memory and then assigned to one of six memory output ports. Here we can see the JPEG slide, normal service, being dragged and dropped from PC memory into Multilogo's memory. Multilogo automatically converts it to the right format, in this case 1080i, and backs up the file in non-volatile flash memory. The file can be assigned to a memory output port by first selecting the memory port in this case the DRAM port, RAM4, and double-clicking the stored file. The other five memory ports have already been assigned as split keys and fills for the three keyers. The Mixer tab is where the key and fill selections are made. Key 1 fill is assigned to RAM1 port, which contains the animated file Globe Fill. Key 1 key is assigned to RAM2, which contains the animated key itself. Key 2 only has a fill assigned to RAM 3, containing the animated file Flag Fill, which will be used as a self-key. Key 3 has a separate fill and key, assigned to the flash memory ports containing the animated file New Logo. Also on the Mixer tab are the selections for the main program and preview outputs. Here, the program output bus is assigned to one of the four live video inputs and preview to the just loaded RAM4 file normal service. Also on this tab are the key enable controls. Here, keys 1 and 3 are selected to the program output and key 2 to preview keys can be faded up and down manually from this menu. A built-in colour mat generator is available as a source for fills or backgrounds. The colour can be set here. The transitions menu enables preview key and background selections to be mixed with the program selections manually or automatically with the user transition rate. All transitions can be previewed. The main program output can be cut or faded to black manually or automatically at a user-defined rate. We've shown the basic mixing and keying functions, but Multilogo can do much more. Multilogo benefits from Crystal Vision's years of expertise developing linear and chroma keyers. In the Keyer tab, we can see the various options for the three key processors. Keys can be self-keyed, where the fill signal itself is used to generate the key. Or split-keyed, where a separate key and fill signal are used. Or full-frame key, where the key size is as big as the graphic frame size. Keys can be multiplicative or additive where the shaped fill is added to the cutout key shape to prevent the aliasing sometimes associated with multiplicative keying. Finally, the key can be inverted or not. 
The key mask menu is used to disable a part of the key by creating a rectangular mask window around it. The key processing menu allows for manipulation of the key black level, gain and transparency. Here, key transitions can be applied manually or automatically at a user-defined rate. The playing of animations can be controlled in the Players menu. Animations can be stopped or paused. Play just once, put on a continuous loop or bounce continuously forwards and then backwards. A powerful feature is the ability to trim the playing length of animations or captured video. Here the key animation is reset to frame 0 and moved forward with the next button to frame 5. This is marked as the new start. The end position is moved backwards with the previous button and marked as the new end. The animation will now only play between these limits. Pressing trim will permanently update the animation in RAM. If the graphic frame size is less than full frame, its position can be adjusted with the left and top offset controls. If two stored files are synchronized, as in the case of the animated key and fill stored in RAM 1 and 2, then locking to RAM 1 will force the two animations to play together using RAM 1's attributes as the master. If unlocked, the playout attributes of either RAM port can be individually set. Either RAM 1 or RAM 2 can be the master. And this feature is available for all six memory ports. Multilogo has up to four video inputs which can be recorded and stored as keys and fills. The fill or key source can be assigned to any live video source. The incoming video can be selectively masked with the mask rectangle. The duration of the recording is manually entered and the recording started. A useful feature is quick text. Here a caption can be typed in and automatically stored in Multilogo's memory to be used as a background or key. The size of the display box can be adjusted. Once transferred, the caption is converted to 1080i format and saved in memory so it can be assigned to a RAM port. In this case, to RAM 4, replacing the normal service slide. Here the caption has been assigned as a key fill and self-keyed, then faded up. So far we haven't mentioned audio. Multilogo has two audio memory ports, which can be assigned in the same way as the video ports. The Audio tab is where the audio player attributes can be set. Playout can be stopped or paused, played just once or looped. The playout can be synchronised to any of the six memory ports or made independent. The routing of ancillary data to the two video outputs can be selected from any of the four external video or two audio inputs. Multilogo can have up to eight GPI inputs. The first four can be used to recall one of 16 presets or to trigger a transition event. The other four, if fitted, can extend the recall to one of 255 preset conditions. Program the GPI input to trigger a preset recall or a transition event. Then select the GPI trigger condition to be a pulse or level. Select the type of transition event. Turn on a key. Trigger a preview program mix transition. Play out from one of the memory ports. All these options can be selected to trigger at the same time. Multilogo has up to three tally outputs that are asserted 
when the selected key is on. The state of Multilogo can be saved and recalled as a preset. Up to 255 presets can be saved and recalled. Once saved, a name can be typed in to make it easier to select for recall. Please contact Crystal Vision for more information.